All right, this is episode seven of Put On Your Boots and Jacket. And today I'm doing the Coach Bomber Jacket. And I wanted to include some jackets in my collection that weren't just um, like esoteric or just like really niche brands, but just something that's kind of mainstream. Um, I think there's a place in my collection anyways for different styles and different brands and um, sort of different aesthetics. Not everything needs to be like a heritage thing for me anyways um uh sometimes you want like more of a modern look or maybe some kind of hybrid of modern and classic so i think that's what you have with this jacket it is a classic um a2 style but um they modernize it in a few ways which i'm going to get into um, we could start with the collar which is the most prominent uh feature about this jacket um it's sherpa removable collar this would be lined with more Sherpa, but in this case, it's uh, just a th really thin nylon lining, which makes it um, a lighter weight jacket, and it gives it like a less puffy look, I think. Um, these pockets are a traditional feature of an A2 or G1 jacket. You have two pockets here and two pockets here. So that is a really cool design. You got the hand warmer, but you can also keep stuff in here and it won't fall out. Um, back to inside the jacket, kind of we're bouncing around here, so sorry about that. Um, you got an inner pocket here with a button to keep your stuff secure. Again, like you put your wallet in here. Then you have another little secret pocket and you could put cash or something like that in there. Um, your zipper is like a gunmetal, like a black zipper. It's really heavy duty. And that's one sign of a good quality jacket right there. So even though it's not like a cool brand, that is a good zipper. This is good leather. It's thin leather, but um, it is a good quality. You can just tell by looking at it. This is actually goat leather. If you look at it closely, you can see the grain kind of resembles cow, but it's kind of like somewhere between cow and sheep maybe. Um, Got the elastic here at the waistline you have elastic here and uh, that's pretty much it um the fit on this jacket it's pretty fitted it's got some room around the chest area it's a little bit longer than a traditional bomber jacket that would hit right here on my waist probably would hit like this and um it's good to have different length jackets depending on what pants you're wearing um the price on this jacket, um, I think brand new, they would go for seven, eight hundred bucks, maybe a thousand bucks. This one I picked up for a few hundred, and if you can get one second hand, you could probably get a similar price as that. And um, that's about it. If you have any more questions, let me know. You can comment if you want, subscribe, all that good stuff. All right, see you next time, guys.